What is going on team? Farley Cannon here and I'm super excited today because I get to share with you guys one of the most unique songbirds in North America and they're living right here on Vancouver Island. They're one of my favorite little birds and I think they're really underappreciated. So without further ado, let's explore the world of the American Dipper. As the seasons change on Vancouver Island, the winter rains begin to fall. With an immense influx of water, the coastal rivers transform. They crash down the mountains with unstoppable force and erode channels in the rocks. As the cold sets in, these rivers reach frigid temperatures uninhabitable for most birds. There is, however, the most unlikely bird living in this harsh environment. With drab grey colours, it is well camouflaged against the rocks. Bobbing up and down, it dances along the edge of the river. No larger than a robin, this curious little songbird seems very out of place. They have small dexterous feet that they use to grip the rocks and navigate the slippery terrain. The dipper will stand in fast flowing water and grab food as it passes by in the current. It has an unusually thick layer of feathers that help keeps it warm in the cold temperatures. That takes care of the cold, now how to do with the freezing river water. Staying dry is a vital part of living along a river in a temperate rainforest. They waterproof themselves by adding an oil to their feathers while grooming. They also have a nostril flap that closes to prevent water from entering their nasal passage. The combination of these evolutionary traits allows them to dive down underwater and hunt for aquatic insects, larvae, and small fish. Lacking the usual webbed feet found in most diving birds, the American Dipper uses its wings as paddles. Its tiny size and powerful wings allow it to fight against the fast-flowing river. Missed. Better try a different spot. And success at last. Now how to deal with it. Unable to eat a fish whole, dippers use rocks to crush their pay into smaller bite-sized pieces. They build their nests in protected rocky areas alongside these rivers. They sometimes even hide their nests behind waterfalls that only they can access. These dippers are one of the most unique songbirds in North America and they are absolutely a treat to spend time with and watch. Though they are hard to spot sometimes, I encourage you to try and find one the next time you're out hiking along a coastal or mountain river. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.